Hello, welcome to another episode of The Mostly Mike Show. The kind folks at Musui had sent me this digital microscope to review and demonstrate its usefulness on some random objects. I must say, as much as I tend to overanalyze everything, at least from what my friends tell me, it's a wonder that I don't already own one of these. I hate to ruin the story, but this thing is pretty freaking neat as well as entertaining. I'll include the Amazon link below. Clicking this link and making any purchase, not even stuff in the video, really helps this channel improve future content from small commissions that I earn from anything you order. Without further delay, let's see what's in the box and have a closer look. Literally. The microscope arrived packed very well. There's a user manual, a microfiber cleaning cloth, the microscope um, head unit, two USB type C cables, a remote, a threaded extension tube, a USB wall plug, an anti-glare light barrier, the adjustable mounting column, an HDMI cable, the base, complete with LED dimmable lights. There's a UV protector lens that snaps into the end, and there's a 32 gigabyte micro SD card which comes already installed in the head unit. Assembly of the microscope is pretty straightforward. From what I've seen, the threaded extension piece seems to be what most digital microscopes want, but not all of them have. And there it is with the spacer mount on it. Well, the Masui sports that extra four inches that is sure to satisfy any user, with a wider field of view when needed. I'm no biologist, but the lights on both the lens and the base are dimmable using these nifty touch dimmer bars on the head unit as well as the base. The remote control can control the zoom as well as the video recording and picture taking functions. That's right, this thing's got it all. There's a plethora of user customizable options in the menus such as white balance, brightness, grid lines, and most other manual camera functions. Height dictates the field of view, and of course there's a wide focus ring on the barrel. Alright, let's look at some stuff. I wanted to demonstrate this microscope on some random objects representative to things that we see in our day-to-day -day lives that occasionally need magnification. The $5 bill was pretty impressive the way it magnified the names of the states across the top of the Lincoln Memorial. Keep in mind too that this is a video of a video, so there's probably some losses in quality that will look way clearer in real life than how it is depicted in this video. A simple hack that I found is if you really want to get the close-up views without the hassles of removing the 4-inch extension tube, simply find something to elevate the object viewed, such as this dog med container that I hoarded. The top is reflective, so to avoid glare, I added a coaster. Face down, of course. Here's a nut and a bolt. Obviously, right? Well, let's zoom out. Pretty neat, huh? I'm sure that the Mercury Dime needs no introduction. Here's a few more old coin shots. Here's a rope. Or is it a thread? Circuit boards really magnify nicely for your day-to-day -day board level electronics repair needs. Need to fix a watch? The Masui's got you covered. Make insects look gargantuan and entertain the kids. See a gnat's eyelash? Use your imagination. I'm no biologist, but whatever your video magnification needs are, the Masui can perform. Okay, so we have it hooked up to a 65 inch television. I'm gonna take a five dollar bill. I mean, look at the clarity, and so there it's in focus, and I can take the remote, and I can digitally zoom it even further now. Um, yeah, it's pretty nuts. You can almost see the height of the ink, that's how clear it is. And we're kind of stacking variables here, we're videoing a video, as I said earlier, of course, it's gonna go a little bit sour when you do that. But I'm telling you, if you've seen this in person, this is pretty neat. I mean, clarity is just unbelievable. Now you can see the focal length is so tight that it's going out of focus, you know, because the dollar bill is actually bowed. See even how dry my skin is on my finger. <laughs> it's nuts. 
Yeah, this thing is pretty cool. Almost looks like Connecticut, they did a typo or something, the way that they made that T so big. I want to thank the folks at Masui for affording me the opportunity to make this review video, and all of you lovely people for watching. Please click that thumbs up button if you enjoyed. Put any questions in the comments below, tell me your favorite joke, or your microscope viewing adventures and inhibitions. I hope that you had as much fun watching this video as I had making it. Thanks for watching this Mostly Mike Show presentation, and I'll see you next time.